There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Divas? What's up, Debos? What's up, everybody? So today, you guys, it's nice outside. I hope you all are having like a really great day. I know I got on me a new Sheen shirt. I know what I said to y'all about Sheen. You know, look, girl, I like the tops. I'm loving the tops. Super cheap. I like when they have their little flash sale, so I paid like $2 for this shirt. Girl, where are you getting a shirt at for $2, okay? Like, where are you getting a shirt at for $2? Anyway, I hope you all are having like a really great day. I'm ready to do this video. I'm I'm going to do three videos today, okay? This is going to be, this video number one, I really wanted to start way before this time because I just want to chill. It's a Sunday. I'm not really sure what day this video is going to go up, but listen, I just want to chill, okay? I haven't worked with this company ever. Not that I know of. Maybe I did. I don't know. I'm not really sure. I don't think so. Might have. Not really sure, okay? But anyway, the company is called Shine. They have the cutest little wig bags. Like, this is the cutest wig bag ever. It's got a handle on it. It's plastic. It zippers up like this. You can turn this into a travel cosmetic bag. Like, straight up, this looks like one of those travel men's cosmetic bags, like, that I've seen at, like, the Dollar Tree or on Amazon. They're always shaped like this, and they always have these handles all the way at the end. So this will make, like, a really good cosmetic travel bag. But besides all of that, I'm going to show you how your wig comes from them when you purchase. And we're just going to jump right right into this video. If I can't have you, I don't want you to have anyone. And if you don't want me, there's something wrong with them, right? Maybe I got problems that I don't tell anyone. Have I lost my perception? Feel like I wanna do something wrong now Packing all your belongings Say you wanna take some time But if you say we'll meet again Why'd you have to take everything now? Baby, are you lying? Have you met someone? Tell me now I better start crying Make them feel bad Before we leave town Ten, nine, counting down talk about how the wig came. Now this is the second pre-cut lace front wig that I've gotten but I think it's rather neat because you don't have to cut it yourself and they just give it like these pink and sheer type scissor cuts you know like the pink and sheer scissors like you can just cut these yourself when your own lace wigs but I like the fact that it came you know like pre-cut but the one thing that like blew me out of the water that I wasn't in was the wig cap. Okay, girl, this reminds me of like a full, like some type of dome cap. It's like created, it's it's made like that, like it's rounds like that and everything, except for it has like this rubber backing right here, which is really great because your wig will just stay in place. And it has combs in it, right? Yeah, it has the, the combs in the normal spot, but instead of it being like a dome cap, it's more or less like a fishnet inside. But anyway, neither here nor there, I did bleach the unit. The speckles in it was not that bad, but you know how sometimes you get like that color treated, color processed hair, you can't bleach the knots? Girl, I'm so glad that these were bleachable because I was determined to bleach them. You know, I'm, I gotta try to make it look as natural as possible. We already know it's a wig, but I don't want it to look so wiggish. So anyway, let's just let's just see how this works out, okay? All right, you guys, so look, I've, I've, I've been able to catch my hair, okay? I've been able to cornrow it to the end. Now, I forgot that this did come with a removable elastic band. And there's pieces right there that I'm trying to show you guys hooks that it can hook into. So the one thing, cool thing about it is it does come with a removable black elastic band. But I didn't really need it for this particular cap. But yes, you guys. So I did end up bleaching the unit. And I was glad that the knots lifted. It is a 5x5 five five glueless chocolate brown. Okay, glueless chocolate brown closure wig. Now... I'm shocked. These these wigs are coming with the lace already cut on them. Like I'm feeling that. I do like that. 
this is like I said the second one that I have tried out and they do a really good job with cutting it I know that they're using like the pink and sheer scissors you can look it up on Amazon uh, for the pink and sheer scissors they do have those but this wig actually was kind of like a shocker to me because I wasn't expecting it to look really like so nice and full like this you know when you get certain units you know it just they just don't look so full but this one looks so full very nicely full okay it is 180 percent in density and it's 22 inches and it is 100 percent human hair brazilian so i like the fact that they already cut the lace for you look make my job easier honey i'm good with that okay but they're calling this color a chocolate brown more like an auburn to me i would say what do you guys think either way the color is very pretty it's a very nice colored wig so i do like the color a lot y'all know i'm not like the biggest hugest fan of baby hairs but i'm gonna do some just for this particular wig because you know i want to camouflage any bit of lace that might seep or show um i did not hairspray it down as you guys seen which i'm just gonna spray a little bit of hairspray it's some for some reason i always forget to hairspray a wig down when it comes to a closure wig like I don't know why but I always forget to hairspray it down I mean you don't really have to so you know I'm gonna just do my thing put this little melting band on okay and just go with it I like the color because it matches my freckles a lot like they're dead spot on and I think like this color goes well with me um, this or like a blonde but like I always tell you guys so I can do straight blonde it has to have like some browns in it so I like these color browns, like this particular color right here. I like this particular color. I think it goes well with me. I've got like, like I've got this country vibe going on with this shirt and this hair. Like I've got this country vibe going on. But it's a very nice wig. It's a decent wig. I'm gonna have to look up and see if I've ever worked with Shine before. Y'all let me know what y'all think of this unit. I'm gonna just continue to curl it. Y'all know what I'm gonna do the rest, okay? Shine here. I really feel like I did work with them before, but you know, hey, we, we shall see. We shall see. I'm gonna have to just go on through my archives of videos here on YouTube and see how it do. But the wig came out cool. It is a middle part that I gave it. You know, this is how it came. So because it came like this, you know, I bleached it and then I just made sure to put the part back like this. And especially because it's a middle part, you know, I just was like, you know what, I'm gonna try something different. Hopefully it worked out in my favor. And it kind of did, you know, I hooked it up. The lace, you know, you got to do your own thing. You have to do your own thing. But, you know, the hair is like a medium, I, I want to say like a medium luster hair. Now, as for the cap fit, now, listen, I was missing the adjustable straps in the nape area, but it does have a nice good stretch. 
I'm not sure if it's because I'm damn near bald headed. You know, my hair is short, but it has a nice stretch. It fits nice. Is it tight on my head? It's not anyway, tight. Though, so the color is pretty. I do like the color of it. The one thing that I was annoyed with was the, the little short hairs. I can't stand the little short hairs. So I had to make them do what they did. But as far as the density, decent. I think this is like average looking like any other wig that you're going to see. It was just, it just threw me off the cap construction of it. Like there's no adjustable strap in the name, but it just is like a dome cap on like a mesh kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Like either way, if it's good, the rubber banding around the inside of it does help it stay down, which is a plus girl. Okay. Where are they making these? Where are they getting these caps from? I'm going to need to like try to purchase some of these, these caps. Cause um, yeah, girl, hello. <laughs> The hair goes well with the shirt. I feel like I'm like, I'm giving off country vibes, okay? Country vibes with a New York accent living in Arizona, okay? Like down south vibes with a New York accent living in Phoenix, Arizona, like on the West Coast, okay? That's what this is all given right here. Me and my sheen shirt and earrings, we're giving those vibes. But girl, listen, you can take, you can definitely check Shine Hair Wig. You know, very affordable. Who don't like affordable, okay? Like for real, for real. Either way, I would definitely see y'all in the comments. Let me know what y'all think of this wig. What was y'all con? What was y'all thoughts on the banding, the cap construction, the little cosmetic now bag that I'm going to be using as a cosmetic travel bag whenever I decide to go somewhere because I really don't get out much. But yes, I love you all. Stay diva and devolicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs the damn video up, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace. Go, go, go.